so there are all these works. Preparatory works are going. So for me and for all of us who are in ABC, should Bonnie trust Buhari? Yes, we can trust Buhari because of the two things he has done for us. These are just the two I am picking out. I don't want to talk about his insistence and making sure that a bunny man comes to the political protection. I only want to talk about these two. Just tell the people, just for these two things, we can trust Buhari. You come to our candidate, Deleko, why should we trust him? We can trust him because he has abandoned everything he is doing for himself to bring himself to pursue the cause of the growth of River State. And for a man to, to talk about growing an economy, a river's economy, there is no other thing we can ask for. For me, he has the clear vision of how to solve the river state problem. And he is the only man today that has the capacity to bring every reverse man back to settlement, on the settlement table. Because himself, he is not involved in any of this big thing. Oh, this, this one, he is not involved. And as a pastor, he is coming to stand to bring every person back on the table so that River State will again grow. And for that reason, I believe that he must and should be trusted by our people. Can we talk about why we should trust Dabota? Should we talk about that? No. Don't every person know it? Fine. No. Someone has devoted her own time her own energy, her own resources, all the things you can talk about, which she could use to run any business that would be giving her 10,000 every day or 20,000 every day. But for a period of eight years, she had devoted her time and energy in ensuring at some point for the training of our young women at another point for the support for the elderly in the community, at another point for building skills for our women. Such a person, if our community cannot trust such a person, then it means that we are far from the truth. So we can trust her. So we can hand over the future of this community to her. Let go and represent us. We'll be sure. She can use her, her own resources to build and develop our people. It means when she's the, in the environment of government, she can use her position to attract more training, attract more employment, and attract many more things to the community. And that's the reason why we have to trust her. Then our candidate, Asita. You know Asita. I called him in the palace silent performer. He had been a strong partner with us, and I told you how he partnered with us. The employment center, the status we have today at the Boni Employment Bureau, which I enforced when I was in government, I have explained to you how it was Astita who did everything to make sure that we achieve that. And for such a person, he wasn't running an election that concerns Bonnie then, and he did that for us. So when he will now run election and represent us as our senator, it means he will do even more. So that is the reason why we must trust him and vote for him. So you will tell them that these are the reasons why we must trust Asita and we will vote for him. And then our brother Fubara Hart, you all know that in this community, he is also another man that has spent his time, his energy, his resources to build youth, particularly in his community. And some people will tell you, why didn't he do generally? Charity begins at home. So if a man can, in his own community, 
take care of other people who are not his children, it means when he has opportunity to lead, he will care for everybody. And besides all of this, Fubara Heart is the only reason why we will have one best human being at the National Assembly. If we cannot go with him, it means Boni will not be heard, Boni will not be represented in the National Assembly. And Boni has grown past the level where we will not have somebody representing us in the National Assembly, whether in the lower house or in the upper house. And for that, we are trusting and believing that every one Boni person will come out to vote for Fubara Hart. And so for me, clearly, all our candidates deserve the trust of this community. All our candidates deserve the vote of this community. So as we go out today, let us peacefully remind everyone of the, these choices that we have made and the reason why we invite everyone 